Hey, what's up everyone? Today I've got the buns and today I'm gonna talk about how to get started on Solana. I'm gonna go over three steps. I'm gonna go over first, how to get a Solana wallet. And secondly, how to use Coinbase to actually get some soul, which is the, the currency of the Solana blockchain. And number three, I'm gonna actually use that soul to buy something on Solana art. Hopefully something not too expensive, just cause I wanna show you how it's done. What you can do is Google Phantom Wallet. Uh, Phantom is a popular crypto wallet for Solana. Just add the Chrome extension. And then it's downloading. Okay, uh, and then yeah, you basically have a new wallet. Create a new wallet. It'll give you this uh, secret recovery phrase. And what this is, is that it's the only way you'll be able to recover your account if you lose it. So store this, all these phrases together. Um, I would not recommend saving these onto an online cloud storage like Google Drive or uploading it anywhere where, you know, if something gets hacked or like emailing it to yourself because if, song, if it gets hacked, then anyone can recreate your wallet and have access to your funds. I wouldn't take a picture also if you have like Google Cloud or Google Photos or iCloud Sync. Again, that uploads it to the internet. Um, okay, so anyway, I saved it somewhere. Create a password. I'm just gonna make a password. Agree to the terms of service, save, keyboard shortcut. All right, cool. Um, and then finish. Yeah, so now you have a phantom wallet and what you can do is go to the upper right here to extensions um, and click phantom and your wallet will come up and you now have a phantom wallet. And you can use this to get soul, um, which is the, the crypto that Solana uses, but we're gonna go through Coinbase because Coinbase is a really popular and easy platform to get started on with crypto and it's available in over 100 countries so if you're international uh, coinbase is probably i don't want to say probably but um, there's a good chance it'll be available in your country so we'll just do that so that literally is your wallet um, so now let's go to coinbase i won't go into how to get started with coinbase but sign up if you don't have an account um, all right, so once you got into Coinbase, now it's time to actually buy some soul. Uh, Coinbase lets you, you know, connect to your bank account or use your credit card to buy a crypto. So that's how you can onboard your, whatever your fiat currency is and convert it into soul. Um, one thing to note is that to transfer soul from your Coinbase account to your Phantom wallet, you need to transfer a minimum amount of 1.12 soul. So Right now, Soul is about $150, so it's probably safe if I buy $200 worth of Soul. I don't want to buy Bitcoin, so change that option right there. Search for SOL, there it is, and then hit Preview Buy. And okay, I'll be purchasing 1.25 Soul, so that's more than enough to transfer. And just gonna hit Buy Now. The Coinbase fee for me was $299 USD using my bank account. If you use your credit card, it's gonna be a different um, fee, so make sure you pay attention to that. And great, uh, successfully purchased. I can view the transaction. It's gone through, I've added 1.25 soul. And now let's send this soul to the Phantom Wallet. So over here on the right or on the top right, you can click send and receive. So yeah, hit send all. I'm just gonna send all of it. Um, and then this part, the two, you're gonna send it to your own phantom wallet address. So again, back on extensions, you're gonna get hit phantom. And then next to wallet one or whatever you named it, it's you're gonna see this, um, this line of numbers and letters and that's your public key. And what your public key is, is basically um, the ID for your wallet. And you can just click it to copy to your clipboard and then back on Coinbase, I'm just gonna paste it in. Make sure you copy and paste your public key because if you send your soul or any crypto to the wrong address, you're, it's gone forever. So you wanna make sure you get this 100% right and copying and pasting is the safest way as well as double checking. <laughs> um, 
to note, we're gonna do just for demo and then pay whistle and then continue. Just gonna double check everything. No Coinbase fee. The network fee is really small because Solana is has low transaction fees and just gonna send it now. And then I need to enter my two factor to authorize sending this. Great, so I've sent all my soul to this address and I can double check by going back to extensions. Remember, that's where you're gonna access your phantom wallet. Hit phantom and boom, there is 1.87 soul. And so now I've successfully set up my phantom wallet, signed up with Coinbase, transferred my fiat currency and converted to soul and got it into my phantom wallet. And now we can go you know, you can do whatever you want. Let's go to Solana, which is a NFT marketplace um, to actually buy something with, with our soul. All right, so now I finally found a project, uh, DGen Lizzie's. I'm just gonna buy it to show you how it works. Um, it's gonna cost me 0 0.58 soul. And what you do is now you just hit like connect wallet to buy or connect your wallet. You're gonna be able to choose Phantom connect and your wallet will pop up and ask you to connect to salon art which is safe to do great your wallet is connected i have a balance of 1.87 and i can purchase one i'm just going to purchase the cheapest one hit buy and a transaction will appear and kind of show you yeah like it's going to cost me 0.58 soul and there's the network fee and approve And congratulations, I have just, or you have just bought your first NFT on the Solana blockchain. Done. Um, and then on Solana or whatever platform you're on, you can actually check your, your NFT. The good thing about Phantom Wallet is if you go back to Phantom Wallet, you can actually hit this uh, squares tab on the bottom and it'll show you your collection of NFTs. And there's my DGen Lizzie with a description, link, properties, and everything. And as you saw, um, I was at 1.87 and this cost me about 0 0.58 and it did decrease. So yeah, that's it for this video. To recap, we went through the entire flow on Solana. We first got set up with Phantom Wallet. And then second, we actually got some Sol via Coinbase where we onboarded our fiat currency. For me, it was U USD and converted that to Sol. And third, we transferred the soul from Coinbase to our Phantom Wallet and actually went on an NFT marketplace and bought an NFT. So that's pretty much it. Um, if you have any questions, please leave a comment or if you want a direct, faster response or just wanna chat anything blockchain, crypto, NFT related. I'm also working on an NFT project called Chibi Shinobis, which is the cutest anime inspired NFTs also on Solana. And we have a Discord going on uh, where people you know, just hang out and talk about this stuff. So I'll leave links to the Discord and the project in the description below. But otherwise, uh, I hope this was helpful and I'll see you in the next one. Yeah, peace.